guys, so we're on a road trip right now. So Sparty TV is going stateside. We're going to uh, New Hampshire to a place called Concord. Uh, we're going to go see our friend uh, Bill Boda from Webboard. So here we come, Bill. Hey guys, it's Pierre from Spider TV. Well, today I'm live here in New Hampshire. I'm in Concord. Am I saying that right? That's correct, yeah. yes. I'm in Concord, New Hampshire. Came all the way down from Montreal to see Bill uh, from Webboards. We're at his shop and we're going to give you a behind the scene on this fabulous product, the floorboards that he makes. You doing good today, Bill? I'm doing very well, Pierre. Thank you for coming all the way down. Uh, I know it's a really long trip <laughs> and I'm, I'm glad it was such a nice day for you to come down on. Thank you very much. Let's talk a little bit about the shop here. I had the, the chance to walk through. We're going to give some videos to the, to the guys so they can see what, what it looks like. But uh, it's not just a, a shop for web boards. I mean, maybe tell us a little bit how you came to make floorboards for the Spider RT. Okay, well, sure. Um, we do a lot of ventilation control and uh, dust collection systems. Uh, it is a job shop, so there's really all kinds of product coming through stairs and rails. Okay. Uh, but, you know, I decided uh, when I bought my 2012 RT, uh, I really didn't like the foot pegs. So I decided why not build my own. I did search the internet and uh, there's a lot of nice boards out there, but nothing that I was really looking for. Uh, so that's when I decided to, to start with the web boards. Okay, so you make your own first pair, you put a lot of heart into it and all that. You go, you put them on your spider, you go out riding. What happens? You're, you're getting some head turns that people are noticing? That's exactly what happened. Uh, friends, you know, they had suggestions and okay. we changed things a little bit uh, until we came up with this. And everywhere I go, people are asking where I bought them and I say I make them. <laughs> so it's, uh, it's been very, very, very good business. And, and we can see from the, the products that you have now, you have different sizes, you have different uh, layouts as well. I see that uh, you have a spider web that's tight, the pattern is tight, and then more is open. Others are open, so the holes are different sizes. I think you have different patterns that are available. You have different colors that are available now. That's correct. So we have uh, the blue, we have the pink, we have the red, we have stainless, and we have black. That's right. Okay, mm -hmm. you have the mini boards coming out. That's Maybe right. tell us a little bit about that new product. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the mini boards, uh, we designed them because people were asking if they could put the RT boards on with highway pegs. And it, it's not possible. There's a little bit of interference there. So we decided to make a smaller board because of the, the request from people. And uh, some people just like the smaller style too. So that's that's why we did that. Okay, and that's available in black and stainless as well? Or do we have limited colors in those? At this time, black and stainless, and we do have a pink side. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And I see as well, we're going to be presenting to people, you have inserts for the passenger as well, if, you, if they want to match the look. That's right. Uh, there's a rubber insert right now that BRP puts in. And if they wanted to, to go with the, the same black line X as the uh, front peg, uh, the front board, excuse me, yeah. then um, they, they have the option to do that. And they're very simple to change out. <laughs> 